Welcome back guys. It's time for some more Batman. Let's go ahead and examine this right now. I've seen these outfits before. Same mercs that broke into City Hall. One thing I really like about Batman so far, he doesn't do the I'm Batman. The voice. Hurts his voice. I'm Batman. <laughs> it's like slightly different, but it's not like exaggerated or anything. Man, there's so many choices. Like I wanna interact with everything, but I don't want this episode to drag so long, you know? So let's go ahead and look at the this door over here. The canister exploded, sending shrapnel right through the container door. For once I'm glad you arrived after the heist. Your armor wouldn't have protected you against that. Damn, that's serious. Some weaponry there. Nice. Damn, look at that, guys. Looks like a bullet started this. A normal bullet couldn't have caused that explosion. Doesn't appear normal. The point of entry's melted. Hmm. I don't know where to connect this. The scrap of metal is from an exploding canister. But I need to know what caused the explosion. Hmm. Not all connected items. Oh, I couldn't. I'm gonna break the link here. Let's look at some more stuff here. White Rose. Falcone's calling card. He's been busy as of late. Send the drones hunting. I want to know his every move. Good thinking, sir. Everything bad that happens, it's like I think it's Falcone. Everything bad. I just have a feeling. Jeez, look at this guy. Dead mercenary. No. That bad. Oh, there's a bullet. Bullet hole. Face slashed. Throat torn open. So not natural. Was that Catwoman? How come I can't? Oh, okay. Skyline Club. Is that where she works? So we got a burnt cop over here. This man's been badly burned. But the damage seems to originate from inside his skull. Oh, that's what nasty. Did this. What are you doing? <laughs> Use L to find the bullet and extract it. Oh, okay, there it is. Sensors say it's an incendiary round. Phosphorus residue. This could have superheated the contents of the canister. Causing the aforementioned boom. Bloody hands. Blood. Broken nails. Bits of human flesh. Hmm. Find a connection. The bullet that killed the cop is the same type that blew up the canister. Well, I'm sure they didn't find that at a local gun store. It appears military. Some connections right there. Continue linking 
related ev evidence reconstruct the crime. I'm not sure how long it's going to take me, but uh, let me go ahead and give this a try. The cop shredded this merc to pieces, barehanded. God, what would cause someone to do that? The nerve agent could make them psychotic. Maybe this is the gas that made him go ballistic? It's a cop. The force grows thinner every day. Hmm. Canisters were stored here. Canisters are what? Someone drove off after the explosion. Have you put it together? Yes. Falcone leaving his rose here. This is a message. Dead cops, stolen chemicals. He's making a big move. The snipers hit a canister with an incendiary bullet, causing it to superheat and explode. This may have been a distraction or a way of destroying evidence. Cops moved in to stop the theft. Falcone's men gunned them down. Then things turned grim. Possibly due to the psychoactive nerve agent. A cop ripped up a merc's face with his bare hands. And was put down. Same sniper, same type of bullet. Looks like Falcone's men got what they wanted and escaped. What did they get though? Have you located the shooter? No, but based on two impact trajectories, the canister and the dead cop, the shooter could only have a clear shot from there, there, or there, and would have contaminated himself with the phosphorus residue. Program the skimmers to pick up that signature. Right away, sir. Man, look at all these toys here, man. It's looking good. Both targets could have been shot from here. But no phosphorus trace. All right, let's go to our left. Oh, there it is, I think. Phosphorus spike. Clear vantage point. We have a winner. Hmm. <laughs> Killing time. Must have been there for a while. This is the right spot. So where did he go? Out the window. Right? Trace stops here. Then he should be nearby. That's true. Found him. There he is. Is Time he alive? Work. Oh shit! <coughs> Gotta scare him. I ain't telling you, Jack. Trying to scare a confession out of me? I won't break. Your bones will. It's true what 
what they said about you. You're a freaking animal! Give me a reason to stop. You know you can bleed to death without ever spilling a drop. Mm. All on the inside. Tell me the plan. Or I start swinging. If you're gonna hit me, hit me! Let's break the ribs. Tell me! The Catwoman supposed to hand over a drive had the container number we needed, but she flaked. So we had to find it ourselves. Uh, container by container! Uh, someone must have heard us. Called the cops. We were told no witnesses. Why risk open war with the GCPD? Some kind of chemicals. <laughs> Malcone wanted them. What are the chemicals for? We were paid to steal them, not ask questions. <laughs> I start here. Turn away, guys. Keep breaking until you answer. The chemicals! There's some kind of explosive! A weapon! I don't know! Balcone said he'd use them soon! Used? Where? That's all I know! I swear! I swear! I mean, I told you everything I know! You're an animal! I was just here for a pickup! I swear! I don't believe him. You'll never hold a gun steady again. Oh God! Jesus Christ! These are cops. Get an ambulance in here. Think I need to call the coroner instead. Time to disappear. Send the cleanup unit to the. I was wrong. I'm gonna need that ambulance too. The hell's going on tonight, Lieutenant? That man. Nah, what? I'm the bad guy either way, man. You're taking this too far, Bruce. I mean, it's Telltales, man. I'm the bad guy either way. You assume the persona of a bat, but you're not an animal. You nearly killed a man tonight. I wasn't gonna kill Your him. Come on, guys. Didn't raise you, this way. you know me. And neither did I. Look, I did what, what you had to, but at what cost? We both know how this argument goes. Especially now, during this. <laughs> preposterous attack on your family you must show the world the true nature of a Wayne giving everything to the city and then being murdered for it my thoughts exactly every time you leave this cave maybe we went too far you know I'm not sure you're a good man Bruce good just like I thought we were gonna break his arm he'd be like I'll talk I'll talk I don't mean to be a doddering old fool on the subject but as a friend the burden of advice falls on me. Trust me, I won't lose my way. It's quite understandable to stray from the path now and again. So long as you can find your way back. You bury the person, Bruce, but you never bury the memory. Sometimes I wish I could. That night, that alleyway. It made me who I am. I can't get it out of my head. That is your gift and your curse. Being Batman can allow you to turn back the tide of treachery that's reached this city's shores or drown you in its sorrow. When you doubt your fate, remember why you started all this. Remember that boy in the alley. I won't forget. Neither will I. Well, back into the fray again. Maybe we, we strayed too far, but it's okay. It's okay. Let's look at this, uh... Actually, let's look at the Gotham feed. 
corruption rumors, tarnish Wayne, and get out of here. Let me see. Let's go to the codex. I just want to check this out real quick. What does it say about uh, Catwoman? Yep, it updated. Turns out her real name is Selena. Alright. Okay. Let's go ahead and check out that uh, bat that computer. Like that egg finally cracked. And inside, Mayor Hill was What do you guys think is in it? More than I could have imagined. This is a complete manifest of Carmine Falcone's criminal organization. What in the world was Hill doing with all this? Illegal arms dealing, drug running, mob hits, money laundering. Falcone's been involved in everything. But it goes back years. Do you see Dad's name on any of these documents? I'll run a search, but so far I don't. Oh. This is it, Alfred. With this proof, we can finally knock out Falcone's organization. Where would we possibly begin to dismantle it? This is a police matter. There's only one cop we can trust to handle this evidence correctly. Lieutenant Gordon. He could mobilize the entire police force against Falcone. What about that reporter from the Gazette? Vicky. Yes, uh, Miss Vale. She could release this evidence through proper channels. I suppose it comes down to who you want to help most. Or who you think could do the most good. <laughs> this is a tough choice right now because I think James Gordon, you know, kind of allies himself with the governor. I mean, he took all my stuff, all the Wayne Enterprises, trying to find some dirt. But then we got Vicky Val here. She so shows up out of nowhere, wants to become the White Knight, you know? I'm not sure. Like, the other choice is not good. But I kind of want to win over James Gordon and the police. But I just don't know. You know, James doing his job, taking my stuff. But there's just something about Vicky. I just, she's a reporter. I don't know. You know, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. It's going to be tough. Be tough here. The data. I feel like this data should go in the newspaper, but this puts Vicky in danger. But James Gordon can't be trusted. He does what the mayor wants. Or does he have a good heart? It's like a one time deal with the data. A lot of this is going by so quick. I'm trying to speak of like what I understand so far. Hmm. I feel like I should go with Vicky, but I'm giving her so much trust. I don't know. She hasn't proven herself. She keeps invading the house. All right, give me one, give me one minute, guys. Figure this out. Hmm. I'm gonna go with Vicky, see what happens. Vicky showed faith in me. She, she cares did. About the she truth. did. She'll get the story out the way it needs to be told. A wise decision, sir. We'll attack Falcone on two fronts tonight Vicky through the media, and Batman by any means necessary. Whatever Falcone is planning, it ends tonight. He's a spider, Bruce. Eyes everywhere. A dense web of goons poised to trap you. No one has ever managed to bring him down. I haven't tried yet. Please don't end the episode right here. Please don't do it. If it does, oh my god. The cliffhanger. Good. <laughs> Th 
This, this is big. You drop a bomb like this, th there's gonna be fallout. That not even Falcone can survive. Why give it to me then? You don't know how much I appreciate it, but you're a Wayne. You could have given it to anyone. I want to turn the entire city against Falcone. The media, the public, the police. Once the story drops, every single person connected with Falcone will turn their back on him. What this could do for the city, my career, I'm just wondering what the cost is going to be. Is she convincing? I don't know, Bruce. Falcone doesn't like bad press. If I run this story, I put a price on my head. The next time my name appears in the media, it, God, it might be an obituary. Falcone has a way of handling reporters he doesn't like. I'm gonna I try to protect her. I'm putting myself in real danger by trying to expose him. I'll protect you, I promise. Oh, chivalrous, but unnecessary. You're not Batman. I always think, crime in the city, it's a hydra. You cut off one criminal's head. Three more appear in its place. I know. I'm trying to convince Unless her right now to do kill it. Kill the beast once and for all. But who's even capable of that? If we don't act fast, that void will be filled by someone far worse. Wouldn't be the first time. Let's talk about Batman. Batman's a symbol of hope, and that is better than any army. If Gotham can rally around him, right now he's just a monster of the week. It's a good thing you gave this to me instead of the police. Could end up buried in some evidence locker and not on every screen in Gotham where it belongs. Public attention. That's what brings down men like Falcone. Not a bullet. Though after my story runs, he might get that too. I'll be seeing you, Bruce. Having mixed feelings right now, but I think I made the right it's choice. Done. Good. So is our hunt. The drones located Falcone downtown. But I have a copy of that, Bruce. And that USB park. somewhere, man. Although you're not dressed for that kind of party. Well, I can always change in the car. Did you just? You can't be serious, man. That is sick. <laughs> ah, it's like either way, I feel like I'm not going to see those files again. The only thing I would have changed in this episode is breaking that guy's arm. I thought I was going to break his arm, he'd be like, I'll talk, I'll talk, but he can't use that part of his arm anymore. Ah, oh, too bad, like I'm the bad guy now, man. Not sure what's going on right here. Cameras and scanning tech are fully functional. All right, let's find Falcone. Oh shoot! Oh, we can move around. Let's test this out. Let's look at the balcony. Good point of entry. Where can I move? My. Am I trying to get in? Where's Nikki? In lockup. Again? Christ, Kimmy. What are they pinching for now? Some hit down at the docks. Nikki? No. I didn't think he was a hatchet man. You and me both. Well, does he got an alibi? Honey, I'm always his alibi. I'm just trying to get all the choices right now. Nothing here. What is that on the wall? Just art? The white rose. Falcone's symbol. A red rose after tonight. Okay, so this is as far as we can go. So I'm guessing we have to go in there. I lost track right there, guys. Who is this? You make your rounds? Yeah. No broken bones. Still healing from the last time I died. All the 
took was a couple of C notes this time. Nice and easy. Like some easy my ass. I know it burns powder at night. The whole city can smell it. Right, I'm just picking every option right now. Any gossip? <laughs> Tell me another. What's the difference between the Mafia and City Council? I don't know. Aren't they the same thing? Only one of them is organized. Ooh. <laughs> You're cute. So, uh, are you alone? Not anymore. Doing some game? How do we get in here? Security camera. Cameras. The entire floor is under surveillance. You'll be detected as soon as you enter. No time for subtlety. So I guess we're just going in there. All right. Got to be Falcone's hideout. Well, it won't be as easy as ringing the doorbell. Four armed guards. Stealth not an option. Put together a plan of attack. Stand by. How is he gonna do this? Hmm. Couple of options for taking this guy down. So that's how I'm gonna take that guy down. Guess I'm like trying to figure out everything right now. Okay. <laughs> Damn, he's gotta be so quick to make this happen. Where's the other guy? That's gonna be nasty. We do the hanging light. Nice. Is that everybody? I think there's only one more person left. This one might be tricky. Any ideas? I've got it covered, Al. Throw him off the railing? <laughs> Going in. Let's Go. go. Very good, sir. Your turn to crash his party. Action commands, here we go. Oh shit. <laughs> Can't mess up. Dude, these are going too quick, man. No, I messed up. Oh, no. All right, let's go. Oh, no. Oh, shit. Everybody dies, I guess. You got no goddamn right Oh shoot, come on. Let's bring him down. Oh no, you're not getting away. Oh shit, that looked like it hurt. Damn, he's still walking. 
Yo, this guy is stubborn. How about this one? You can't sneak up on me. Oh shit. Did I get it? What is going on? <laughs> yeah. You think that's gonna work? I'm gonna light up this Damn, Batman is slick right now, man. Get your goddamn hands off of my suit! I you know I don't know what this is gonna do. Stay down, Falcone. We can end this now. You got a lot to learn, kid. Oh no. You gotta duck that shit, man. Explosives armed. Fire when ready. Yo, I gotta aim. First choice, I picked it, guys. I should have hit the gun away. Talk. Answers now. You would not. All right. All right. The killers. Where are they? What? I found your calling card at the docks. The white rose. You think I wanted to lead you here? Was he set up? Yeah. Something. Weeks about this old thing, and it ain't a dead bat. Still want to play games? We're all being played here, including you. Those chemicals you're so riled up about, they're mine, all right? This isn't good. Police are here now. But someone is trying to cut me out of the deal because I. Did not make that mess at the docks. Then who did? No, with that. Gotham's watching now. Ah. Go ahead. Give him a show. I'll be walking free by tomorrow morning. Ah. I'm not gonna brutalize him. We learned from our first mistake. Dude, I didn't want to mess that up. He falls and dies, game over. Spill it, Falcone, while you still can. It's the wings. They're behind all this. What do you mean? You want to save this city? Well, the wings are the biggest gangsters in Gotham. What? His dad was really corrupted, I guess. Thanks for the assist. Now we only have to take one of you down. Open fire! Damn, they're shooting at me. It's messed up. That theme song for Batman, though. It's hype? <laughs> Room with the view. Got another trophy. Fire and smoke could reportedly be seen from street level. Tonight, the Skyline Club, a high-rise mafia hangout in downtown Gotham, was the arena for a clash between the notorious Batman and alleged mob boss Carmine Falcone, who was found dangling over a 50-story drop. Bet Falcone loved that view. Though I'd say the crime boss getting his is well overdue, Falcone has slipped through the law's grasp for years. But after this dramatic arrest and a stunning expose by Gazette reporter Vicky Vale, Falcone's hey. going away for a long, long time. And speaking of newly uncovered criminal dealings, this brings me to the story oh, everyone no. is talking about. The Wayne family. For generations, the big W on the Wayne Enterprises tower was a reassuring sight. 
you knew that there was something pure at the heart of Gotham. That this city, for all its faults, was built by good people. But with Thomas and Martha's shining reputation called into question, we no longer have such assurances. And even worse, it seems the apple hasn't fallen far from the tree. Gotham's greatest son, Bruce Wayne, seen here shaking hands with Carmine Falcone, may be just as crooked as his parents. In his defense, Wayne fired back saying, The Wayne family has always been a cornerstone of Gotham. We have never had and never will have connections to organized crime. In a world where the Waynes, our golden family, are corrupt, who are we left with? Who can Gotham We told Vicky to that. To? What the, the heck, man? Hero Batman? Only time will tell. Meanwhile, we'll keep digging for the truth. But the prominent feeling throughout Gotham is that the Wayne's time in the sun is ending. This is getting good. I don't want it to end. The car. This entire cave. Master Bruce? Everything I built. I created all of this because I didn't want any more innocent people to die. If Falcone's telling the truth about my parents, then what the hell did we do this for? Bruce, I... What have you been hiding from me? Alfred! He has been lying to us. So Alfred was in the picture. No! It's ending. Family secrets. See, uh, did you stick up for Harvey in front of Falcone? I mean, Harvey, get out of here, man. Being corporate, did the right choice. I did provide a quote for Vicky's story, but it was used against us at the very end. But she exposed him, so it's a win-lose situation. She won, I lose, but the cone's gone. But my quote was used in the wrong way. Alright, some more people broke the arm. Feel a little bit good about myself. Not. <laughs> I want to change that. Because I thought he was going to be like, break the arm. Your leg is next. I'll talk. I'll talk. Man, a lot of people give it to uh, Gordon. Damn, that 17%. Vicious. Man, guess that's it. You know, episode one is uh, complete. Let's see. Uh, we can see like some kind of preview. When your parents died, they left me as caretaker of their estate, their son, and their secrets. I would never betray them. Your parents were good people, Bruce. No matter what that thug Falcone told you. Then swear to me, there's no truth to it. That scoop you brought me on Falcone helped me more than you could possibly know. I owe you one. I'm sure Falcone's taken harder beatings in the past. Hopefully this one knocks something useful out of him. Hell of a view. Bruce, the Wayne name is toxic. I have to do what's best for my campaign. What's best for Gotham. I have to... distance myself. I will find the truth. Along with anyone who stands in my way. Man, they better hurry up. Telltales, if you're watching, make that episode real quick, because I want to play it, man. I hope you guys enjoyed, like you're enjoying the series. As soon as episode 2 is out, you know I'm going to be on that episode. So thank you guys for all the support. You know, smash that like button. And I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.